Hey y'all, so we are outside again. Um, I really like to film out here. I think the lighting is really good. I'm sitting on something dirty. <laughs> it also gives us a change of scenery, which is nice because I don't like being cooped up in my room and I'm sure you guys get tired of being cooped up in my room. So we're gonna come out here. So this is my playhouse. If you watched the denim shirt series and you saw this and I think it was episode two, um, but I'm sitting on the porch of, see, the porch the porch of the playhouse and I wanted to do a shoe unboxing so I haven't done a shoe unboxing since my fall haul where I showed you the mezcal boot um, but they are the freebird mezcal boots the ones with the studs and the stuff all over them um, but I just got these cowboy boots that I actually got them back in like September, October, I don't even know. Um, it's been a while and I just have not gotten around to filming an unboxing video so I've been trying like really hard not to show them in Outfit of the Days and pictures because I was like I don't wanna, I wanna do an unboxing video before I use them too much. I've shown them in a couple of, um, I think a couple of Instagram photos and then I showed them in I think maybe one Outfit of the Day but I didn't like make those the spotlight of the video so I don't know if you guys remember them or not. But anyway, so these shoes I got them at Cavender's if you live in Texas or at least the Houston area I don't know if there's Cavender's boot stores anywhere else in the world but that's where you get them if you live in Houston and probably Dallas too there's a dog back here that's creepy um my dog um or not my dog it could be the neighbor's dog <sighs> they have a boxer it's scary but I think it's like blind like my dogs hey puppy 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 yeah, I don't think that's my dog. It is my dog, yay! Maloney! Maloney! There's the Pizza Boy! There he is! Puppy! What was I saying? So anyway, uh, I originally got these partly because a friend got some too. Um, I had a friend, she was in a wedding and she needed help getting her boots. She couldn't go pick them up so I picked them up for her and I and then at the same time my cousin had just bought some boots from Cavender's and I really liked them. So I was like I need to get myself some boots because I had some. There was like the first Instagram photo I ever posted was like a picture of my boots and they weren't real leather. They were like 60 bucks from um, Academy. My brother got them for me so that was really nice but they were worn out. The heel was popping off on both shoes so I was like I need to get some nice like real boots um, so I went originally to Cavender's to go try on the ones that my cousin had gotten um, but then I saw these so I asked to see the ones that she got and these ones and I ultimately went with these one because I didn't think she would appreciate us having the same pair of boots and two I just like these better these fit me more the ones that she got were like a cognac cognac brown color um, they had I think they had lizard skin and then they had like swirls of leather appliques um, and these this one I'll show you in a second but these are more like lace looking leather appliques um, so they are the Corral vintage line Corral's the brand and then vintage is like they had like a whole collection of vintage style boots so both my friend and my cousin got Corral vintage boots these are called the sand and cognac laser overlay boot very uh, very fancy name, not really. And they were two sixty nine. I got them for like two fifty because um, they were on sale. So I'm just gonna show you like all the angles. So as you can see, like especially on the toe part, um, it looks a lot like lace, um, but it's leather. Um, I'm assuming it's cow. Um, it's not like lizard or anything special, but um, or shark. It looks like lace, and it's just very dainty and pretty and I really like them. It's kind of distressed looking. It's kind of a gray taupey color. It's coming across more gray than it actually is and then this is not so red. Like that's kind of what they look like I think. It has stitching all around, has little flowers, little hearts and it's just, they're just cute. So I'm not engaged yet, um, but me and Michael's plan has always been to get engaged. So I want to wear cowboy boots for my wedding. Everybody wearing cowboy boots. That's what I want to do. So I kind of bought these with the intention of would these look good under my dress, because I already know what dress I'm getting to. You guys will be like the first to know when I get engaged. Seriously, I will tell you. So don't, don't, don't worry your pretty little heads about it. I will tell you. So as soon as I'm proposed to, I will let you know. It'll probably be on Instagram. <laughs> They're just really cute and I like them. I kind of picked these out thinking what would I like to wear under my dress. Um, and so these were kind of it. So if I don't wear these, I'll probably get like white ones. Because that's a little more 
traditional, I guess. So I'm just going to stand up and show you the boots like I always do when I show you guys shoes. So I've been wearing these boots with anything from jeans to dresses, skirts, um, leggings. I've been wearing these jeans with everything. Long skirts, short skirts, medium, medium, medium length skirts, just anything and everything. They go with everything I own um, and they just kind of add, the nice thing about cow boots is they just kind of add like a style to whatever you're wearing. Like a lot of times we pair shoes with clothes because the shoes matches the outfit, but with cowboy boots. I like to wear them to where the outfit matches the cowboy boots. So I like to wear things like this. It has kind of a similar motif. Um, I like to wear long dresses just because uh, you kind of just see the boots peeking out from underneath. Um, I just, they go with everything. I'm really, I'm really pleased with this purchase. These boots come up to about mid-calf, um, maybe a little higher than mid-calf. This part is at the mid-calf and then this part is like two inches higher than that. So I have really long legs, but for me it's like if you go like this, like my knee is right here. So it's like four inches from your knee on the sides. Um, the heel is like a, I think it's like a two and a half to three inch heel. So it's a little bit higher than a typical cowboy boot would be, like an actual functional cowboy boot would be. Um, but these are more like fashion cowboy boots, not like I'm going to go, you know, get along little doggy. I'm going to go rattle, rile up, corral some camel camels cam <laughs> cows i live in texas y'all cows not camels camels i don't even know where that came from <laughs> i am slap happy and i need a nap seriously it's sunday i need a nap i need to watch my own video on how to look like you didn't take a nap and just go take a nap oh my gosh okay <laughs> And then the inside is all leather. The whole boot is leather, like, except for the wood. I guess it's a wood block. Yeah, it's like a wood block with a rubber heel. But this is leather. It's got the stitching, which is very nice. And then the inside's all leather. Like I said, it says corral, like, right there. And I wear a size 8, just in case you're wondering. And they fit really well. They have a very pointy toe. Um, more functional cowboy boots are not going to have as pointy of a toe. They're going to have a more like a square toe or a rounded toe. Um, I really like the pointy toe. In high school, I only wore pointy-toed heels. So I just really like pointy-toed shoes. The thing that people don't like about pointy-toed shoes is they make your feet look bigger. So if you have big feet or feet that are not proportional to your body like me, um, I don't have big feet. I mean, I wear a size 8, but I'm only 5'5", five five, and my mom is 5'6", and she wears a 7. So my feet are a little bit not proportionate to my body. Um, so they do make my feet, I mean, this is a big shoe. It looks like a really long, like, it's like taller than my face. But, um, so at first I was like, do these make my feet look big? And I was like, eh. But I kind of don't really care right now. I kind of just... I like them. So I guess I will see you guys later. I'm going to post a picture of the boots on my Instagram when I upload. Well, y'all probably understand it. But anyway, if you want to see the picture of the boots, um, go onto my Instagram. It's Haley Birdie. Um, feel free to follow me and subscribe on my channel if you would like. I'd really appreciate it. It would totally make my day. Um, I love you guys, and I will talk to y'all soon. Bye.